Eight-year-old neighbors Darren Bruff and Natalie Jackson don't realize that their childhood days are numbered, <laughs> that their purpose on this planet is to reproduce and pass on their genes. Deep in Natalie's abdomen are her ovaries. Inside, her blood feeds half a million spherical cocoons called follicles. <laughs> in Darren's testicles, nothing much is happening either. Right, off you go, David. Yo, yo, yo's what I've got to get is Mickey D with my Juliet. Oh, Romeo, oh, but we hit a snag. Why does Montague have to be your tag? Next. Inside Darren's brain, testosterone now soaks through the membranes of dormant cells. It gives him the desire for sex. That much good and this much bad It's the only name I ever had But for you, my love, I would change it now Just click on my heart and find out how Are you wearing perfume? And while Natalie must learn to live with estrogen, Darren is in the grip of testosterone. You're getting a tattoo? Where? Well, either here or here. Mr. Parsifal, he wanted an engineer. A what? Someone who hasn't done it before. Like a virgin? Yeah. Next. So we decided where you want it. I don't know. What do you think? Darren's penis has swollen to five times its normal size. Darren and Natalie are losing control of their bodies to hormones. Yeah, you mean? Yeah, you mean? What's wrong with his face? He's wearing makeup. <laughs> or a pizza face! <laughs> Natalie thinks you're wearing makeup. <laughs> Darren's body is overreacting to escalating hormone levels. And pimples are not the only result. Darren's penis seems to have a mind of its own. Yo, 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 we in the place to be on the wheels of still capular MC. <laughs> And because his legs have grown so quickly, his brain just can't keep up. <laughs> but the fastest multiplying cells in Darren's body are in his penis. Natalie has grown 60 feet of pubic and armpit hair. A text from a homegirl saying chow and three words, mother, bedroom now. Come out the window before she comes. You should have gone when we saw the sun. B.O. is an outward sign of Natalie's emerging sexual maturity. Our ancestors found it attractive. Come over here and don't you diss me. Ain't going nowhere until you... But in our hygiene-conscious world, B.O. tends to have the opposite effect. Natalie, what's your mind over here? Don't think so, squeaky boy. Don't think so what? I don't think that she's interested. Although, I know you do, um... Speak highly of her! <laughs> Increased aggression. Natalie is having her first period. Mom! Mom! Ah! 
Next door, Darren is about to experience a less visible, but equally dramatic change. Make him sorry that he showed his face. Leave it, young blood. I mean it, Dread. Don't need no one to wind up there. I've come so far, it feels so good. But just as in his arms and legs, it's difficult for Darren's brain to properly control his vocal cords now that they are a different length from those his brain is used to. My love. 